sea trial day today. We're here in uh, quite sunny for winter Hillary's in Western Australia. And we're looking forward today to taking out this older 1970s, 1980s style of hull, this beautiful North Shore 37. This boat's name is Tempest. It was previously powered by the Volvo TAMD 70 series engine, which unfortunately was at end of life. We pulled that out, put in a brand new FPT NEF 280 marine engine, and that's really allowed new life to be breathed into this amazingly old vessel to ensure it has another lifespan ahead of it of great, reliable and enjoyable boating. FPT have got a wide range of engines in the marine propulsion selection. Now, the, one of the important things that we offer at THT is that we always come on board a vessel wherever practical to jump on board and work out which engine is best suited to the vessel. One of the important things about this boat here, this North Shore 37, previously had a Volvo TAMD 70C in it, but not a normal vertical one. It laid over horizontally in the engine bay. As a result, this North Shore has a very low headroom height in the engine room. So what was really important is that we offered an engine which was very low in overall height, and we mated that to a gearbox that allowed the engine's nose or front to really sit down as low as possible. So that, so that way the client had an engine that was sitting under floor level with a flat floor. Nothing more annoying than having to step up over top of an engine box inside the saloon. So as you can see, the NEF 280 here just squeezes in, and that's all we needed it to do, was get underneath the floor height. So to achieve that is by the engine having a very, very low height from centerline of crankshaft up to the top of the motor to the highest point up here on the header tank. But the other smart thing we did was we took off the old twin disc MG 507 straight gearbox that was previously behind the Volvo and instead we chose the MG 507A gearbox both in a two to one ratio. Now what that did is that brought down the nose of the engine that previously would have sat up about here due to the, the shaft angle remaining the same through to the gearbox through to the engine. We brought that down seven degrees. That has brought this header tank down to underneath the floor height. For the client, that's a big win being able to have an engine that does fit within the engine room. Results from sea trial gave us a very, very comfortable 14 knots at 2200 RPM. That gives you an excellent long distance cruise speed. Now, as we stepped up from there, we stepped up to 2400 RPM and achieved 16 and a half knots, and the vessel topped out at 19 knots, which is really quite impressive for the North Shore 37 semi-displacement hull, weighing in at about 12 tons. The boat certainly felt very stable, especially having the engine sitting so low down to keep the center of gravity on the boat low, which really stopped the roll uh, as much as possible on these North Shore 37 hulls. 
This boat here isn't based out of Perth, it's actually travelling further north uh, up to Geraldton. So a lot of the applications and use times for this vessel will actually be travelling to the Abrolhos Islands. So what's really important about that is having an engine that is very fuel efficient and is really capable of making long trips. So that's why the NEF 280 is such an excellent engine for this boat, being a 280 horsepower mechanically uh, controlled fuel injected engine really ensures simplicity, reliability and low fuel consumption, especially when cruising at around the 10 knots at 16 to 1800 RPM. It really gives the boat a very, very comfortable long haul cruise. It's been an absolute pleasure to repower this beautiful North Shore 37 Tempest with the NEF 280 marine engine. If you think you have a vessel similar that might need upgrading, no matter how old that boat is, THT can offer a very reasonable repower solution, even for older vessels, to give them a brand new lease on life. I'm Josh from THT. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.